Hello everybody and welcome to Armello. I am joined today by Avac, Orbital Potato and Rhapsody. So very warm welcome to everybody. How are you all doing? Yeah, Excellent. Yourself. Well, thank you. Hmm. Good. Right, I better take my turn before I get a countdown timer. <laughs> I'm going to head out this way. Man, I, I don't know. I don't know who's going to win this game. Like... I thought it was solidly Avac until Rhapsody started rolling literally 20 million dice in one turn. <laughs> mm -hmm. And then I started to get eight, a little bit yeah. worried. He's up to eight. He could challenge the king at this way. Uh, thankfully, it's only the uh, the Banes that I can roll all of that extra die against. Each of you only have one rot, so I only get one rot from you. Yeah. But against yeah. the king, if you could have one more than the king, then... Yeah. It would be rough. Oh yeah, if you have one more than the king, you like, you know, 360 slam dunk him. But <laughs> I've not got enough quest on to get in there. Uh. So if you get the stones, you take you still have to have all the quests or you can't get near the king. You can fight these horrible perils, the king perils on the inside, but they're yeah. basically unmeetable. They okay. are pretty nasty perils, yeah. Plus, it takes all but of your AP to way try. In is, is to beat the king. Mm -hmm. uh, is to beat the uh, quest, yeah. Oh, you're actually having a giggle. All right, well, that seems really good. Sounds fun. What? Yeah. What's Legit. Up? Just lost a quest. Mm. Well, I didn't lose it, but I lost the bonus, so there you go. That does suck. It's true. It's pretty hard. Mm hmm. That's pretty hard. Okay, um... Here's the part where you get offered a king gets one more HP, and you go, No, thank you, actually, please. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh... Uh, yeah, th this is another one that is, is pretty much... I have flat out no option. Would you like bad or worse? Is one of them give rot to Rhapsody? Or, like, is one of them give rot to everybody? <laughs> All right. I mean, that's that's not the worst, I guess. It was a bad card, but the other one was much worse for me. Like, wow. Was it give to HP to the king? No, but it was again do a bad thing to the prestige leader. It's like, seriously? Wow. Okay, take one of these. Interesting. Interesting. We'll see what we can do with that. Is uh, Are you all stealthed at the moment? You're over there. Yeah. I'm stealthed at the moment. Okay. Not sure hey, uh, Sheila. We're allies now. Cool. Uh, I like pack. I like that one. Mmm. I, you know, I don't like that one because nobody ever seems to ally with me. I don't know why. That's <laughs> uh, salty. That's true, actually. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty much it. That's more or less. In a nutshell, that not is, true. That is the reason. Not true, actually, but all right. Not true that you're salty. Not true that that's why no one allies with you. Both. <laughs> mm. Are you gonna cream cracker avac? No, but. I'm not gonna have enough time to finish my turn. What the hell? Ooh, questing. That wasn't my quest. Nowhere. That's twice that's happened to you. That's literally twice that that's happened to you. That is pretty awesome. You must have just an ability to pick up random quests. I have no clue what's occurring here. Um, but what I do know is I'm about to bone myself hardcore. Oh, wow. You are... Are you actually more rotten than the king now? I'm more rotten than the you king, yes. more rotten than the king. Wow. Now I just need to be able to get in, but unfortunately that's going to require me completing two more quests, which I'm not going to be able to do in time because fuck all at all. It's not my fault. Hey, it is your fault, strictly. Fault. Oh, interesting. Yeah. I mean... 
Um. It's just, I'm just burning cards at this point. I need to um, get new cards as soon as possible because nothing in my hand is good enough. I, you, you were closest target. And the only one that was in range for the cards that I had, so I had to use them. I'm afraid. Mm, no, that's okay. I mean, they were good. I mean, yeah, they're not bad cards for you. Like, just, you know. why, why wouldn't you have buffed yourself? What? Mirror image. In battle, opponents against the person you cast that on have negative two die until the end of turn. Oh, damn it. Oh, shit. Awful. <laughs> I didn't read I the card. appreciate that. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Uh, good old reliable... <laughs> <laughs> good old reliable uh, orbital. Not reading a card. Uh, and actually much. helping out his arch nemesis. Mm-hmm. There is arch good. nemesis now. You've gone up in the world, mate. No, like... Yeah, no orbital, I'm building... I'm building bridges right now, okay? I did actually read the card, but I'm, I'm building bridges. Mm -hmm. I see. I see. No, no, of course I read the card. Yeah, he on. changes his story very often. For? He does. This is something that we've come to expect from Orbital. Well, I mean, I think the only winning play for me at this point is just try and fight my way into the King's area. But, uh, but he's dying at the next morning, so I've already burned most chances on that. Yeah. Does a spell have to be put into my inventory before I can cast it? No, you can cast it, but when you drag the spell, like each spell can be played against certain things. And uh, it might say heroes or forest tiles or planes or dungeons. Yeah. Um, so you have to cast it on that, but they also have a range. Oh, I see how they work. Okay. There you go. Yeah. Honestly, but I'm trying to find where the play is to prevent Arvac from winning, but it's it just does not exist. We go into nighttime at the end of this turn. Everyone gets a movement, right? Anyone trying to get into the building is going to lose all their AP, so no one's getting anywhere near the king. Then it turns to daytime. The king dies due to his rot, and Arvac wins. Takes his rightful place. The on only the, the only thing that could happen is if somebody gets like a you know like a if if Arvac gets a a thing that's, that adds life to the king, irregardless of what the option is. I mean, he'd choose the other one. And I don't know I if that triggers be before killed. he dies. We'll have to see. I don't know if there is one last, um, one last king's verdict, or determination, whatever it's called. I think all we can do is try and, uh, debuff him. Dice will not explode until the end of the next turn. Alright. Well, I mean, my die can't explode because I, I don't have trees. Can no die explode for a rock character? I was fairly sure they could. I mean, maybe rock, rock can explode. Your rock dice explode. What is? And right now, if you're playing against another character, you are always in a rock battle because we've all got a little bit of rock. Okay. I don't. Yeah, you might have cleared oh, yours, okay. actually. She's cleared this. Yep. So it won't affect, affect uh, you against you, that. Hmm. Alright. There you go. I'm investing all of my extra hopes and dreams in you, Rhapsody. That's, that's all I can do. I've given you all that I've got. Go forth into the world. I wish Another you well. Fly, like the rabbit, you always knew you were. I, I helped Rhapsody in a major way. This is interesting, because there is possibly something I could do here. That'll help. That'll definitely help. Now oh, you got like one turn to do it, whatever one, it is. One, two, three, and negative one on you. No, I'll, I'll get close to your amount of prestige, but I'm not gonna beat it. Fuck you, Bane. I've invested my hopes and dreams in your Rhapsody. Don't let me down. I mean, I literally just don't have enough turns to do anything, so... I should have just gone for the king. I think you should have gone I, for the I king. I can't, and, um, but the thing is, I can't so get to the king. Guys. No, but I think you should have just in case there was a, a thing that said Avak loses loads of prestige or the king gains an extra health. I think you should have tried that straight. That's, that's what's going to occur here? All right. All right. I think if I win a rot battle, I get HP back though, so it should be fine. Yep. Yeah. Cool. Oh, 
bad. I'll take that, and then I'll fight you. Okay. Oh, you're evading. Yes. Rude as hell. That is. I knew it was coming. I knew it was coming, so I was like, yeah, I'm going to use that spell to evade. <laughs> Made all the sense in the universe. There we go. Pretty bad roll. Mm hmm. You still do two damage. Ah. And that will be absolutely it that I can do here. Yeah. Hooray! I prove! Yep. Yeah. Just gonna lose to uh, passive time. Yeah. That's no, that's that's good. I think that this game has got like a, a very hard time limit. I think that's a, a feature. I really like it. I'm glad that it has a time limit. I'm just not at the moment glad that it has a time limit. <laughs> mm. it does make it more interesting because it's like you get a winner, you know, every certain amount of time. Well, that is true. Yeah. Mm -hmm. A lot of stars, and... but I can't do anything with them really. You gonna try and pop one in the uh, in the king? Just you know, just a little little bit of a no, an arrow. I don't need to. Pop one. Yeah, exactly. I, I'm I'm going to be the creeping bear. How much prestige are you on, Rhapsody? Six. Oh, it's miles away. Yeah. If I'd killed him, he'd be one lower prestige. I'd be one higher prestige. Yeah. Um, and then at the start of next turn, if the king were still alive, I'd get another prestige. But yeah. Not gonna work uh, out like that. For those who don't understand what the significance of evading was, it means that any dice I roll that are attack get converted into defensive dice. So I was just stacking all of my hopes on not dying, being able to block the ridiculous amount of dice that, that Rhapsody was gonna be able to play. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's worth noting, however, that uh, no matter, it, I could have killed him, but it wouldn't have helped. It still wouldn't have swung the prestige enough in my favor. Yeah. I'm wondering. Ooh, Done did you quest. win that one? Yeah, won that one. Very well nice. Done. Not enough, not quick enough, but. Uh... Ah. Tried. I, I'm trying to. To get something that is viable, but there's really nothing. Really nothing right now. It's a shame when the inevitability of your doom just yeah. walks yeah. towards you. Doesn't run, just walks. About 20 minutes of well, I can see how this game is gonna end. Let's let's just watch it end, I guess. <laughs> yeah, that's the that's the inevitability of life, I guess. Uh, RIP! <laughs> Pomp. A king creeps closer to death and is dead, and I am now the next in line. Trusted advisor from the beginning of the game to the end of the game. Uh, mm -hmm. Damn, damn, damn. Good times. Accolades. Now, if we click on this, we'll find out some things. I've got Goldfinger, Wanderer, Healer, and Immortal. Yep, I managed to pick up Corrupter, got... Warlock, Thrifty. I imagine spending the least money. And Vanquisher. Oh, that's interesting because for me it's got socialite necromancer martyr and warlock oh for you see i thought those weren't subjective anymore because you read out your accolades and those are the accolades you have on my screen as well mm. yeah shulab had purist mm -hmm. yeah what does that mean no rot uh, I, yeah oh because i didn't have rot and i got conqueror destroyer infamous and shadow so yeah uh, that's exactly right yeah yeah that's what I i'm seeing as well you can see the sort of vein that i went down yeah, pretty much. Hashtag wrecked rhapsody. That's right, folks. Get that get that shit trending. <laughs> Hashtag wrecked rhapsody. Uh, Sorry, uh, I which was us... more game before I unlock the onyx ring. Oh, I Look see. I I wanted to win a rot victory there to get the spoil amulet, which I think just starts you with one rot. Yeah. So, what are the, are the unlocks for the stuff that you get to pick at the beginning of the game? Yep, yep. So the more games you play and the more things you get. Like achievements and things like that, like the rot victory, which is really hard to get, by the way. And Rhapsody was really close. I yeah. was actually 
kind of hoping that he would win. I, I'll be honest, there's a little part of me that's like, I'd like love to see you win a rot battle against the king. But, yeah, um, just didn't have the time, unfortunately. Yeah, it allows you to pick better things to start the game, so you get a little bit more powerful the longer you play. Mm -hmm. I want you to know, Rhapsody, that, you know, I put aside our differences, and I, you know, I buffed you as much as I could. You put aside our differences when it didn't matter. Don't even yeah, try. Yeah, well, exactly. <laughs> Exactly. You know, isn't that the best time to put aside differences when nobody's prestige is at stake? <laughs> Definitely. You know? Uh, well, I think we'll find out when the best time to put aside differences and make new alliances is in the next game of Armello. Yeah. All right, Sounds well, good. I'll Sounds take good. us out here. Uh, my name has been Rhapsody. Their names have been Arvac, Shealab, and Orbital Potato. You can find links to their channels in the description down below. Next episode, we'll start a new game of Armello. Hopefully, you've been enjoying yourselves, and we'll see you next time. Take care. Bye, Bye everyone.